There's this story at the beginning of the Gospel of John where Jesus calls Philip, one of these first disciples. And Philip's all excited and he runs and he finds his friend Nathaniel and he says, Nathaniel, we found the Messiah, the one that they talk about in the Old Testament. He's here, come with me, he's in Nazareth. And Nathaniel's response is, Nazareth? Can anything good come out of Nazareth? And for a long time, that's how people have talked about downtown Hamilton. I mean, Hamilton doesn't have the best reputation, but despite being called the armpit of Ontario or just looking kind of like Mordor if you drive over the highway and pass by the steel industry, there's a lot going on in Hamilton. And that's what Eucharist wanted to respond to. There's been this influx of people over the last couple of years moving downtown to take part in all the creative work that's happening. And there's been this long history of Christians working downtown for issues of justice and righteousness. And so we as a church sat back years ago, just actually as a, as a team gathering, and said, is there something we could do? Is there a need for another kind of church working with what God has already been doing in Hamilton for so many years? And over five years of brainstorming and praying and thinking and talking, we eventually realized that we were also supposed to be a part of what God is doing. Uh, there was a need for another church doing some things a little bit differently in order to serve downtown Hamilton. And so we have been working now for three years with CBOQ, with other churches in the city, to work at the intersection of the creative work in Hamilton and the justice work of the city, and at that intersection to proclaim the gospel and live the kingdom. And so we were sitting around, about 30 of us, in our living room, talking and praying and prepping for this church plant. And we started asking ourselves questions like, so what are our strengths as a church plant? And well, we're young and passionate and creative. We've got all these new ideas and all this energy, and, and that's good. Uh, and then we started asking, well, what are our weaknesses? And we realized, well, we really have no idea what we're doing. Uh, we have never done this before. We're lacking in some wisdom. We have no outside accountability. And we realized we need a network, a tribe, a denomination to come alongside of us and help us figure out what to do with all of this energy that could really just explode in our face. And so we started talking and over time realized that uh, a really good fit for us was the CBOQ. And, and you guys have been so good to us over the last three years. You've offered support to us, you've offered support with your leadership, with the other churches in the city coming alongside of us, uh, with financial aid and prayer support. We've been really blessed by the CBOQ and we've loved that it's a real denomination and you've given us some fences around ourselves to protect us and make sure that we're honoring God and staying on the path. Uh, but in classic CBOQ style, you've given us some space to explore and ask questions and look at what the gospel looks like when it's planted in downtown Hamilton. And so we've been very, very grateful for all that CBOQ has done to support us as a fresh expression in downtown Hamilton.